Guess what time it is? It's time for Little Fish, a Little Fish Random Review. Welcome back everybody, Little Fish here bringing you another random review. Today, I will be reviewing four toys based on DreamWorks film, Home, released in 2015. Two of these toys I was able to acquire at my local Target, and the other two toys I was able to get at McDonald's. I was never able to find them at my local Toys R Us, and unfortunately the Targets around me only had them for about a week before they sold out and never restocked, so I was only able to get these two mood figures. So why don't we take a closer look at some of these toys? I think we'll start off with the Happy Meal toys, and we will start off with the one for number one. And this is Dancing O. Let's a quick look at the package. Nothing too special. I did try to get the whole set. I believe in America we had six figures, and in other places there were at least ten figures. But unfortunately my McDonald's only seemed to get the same three figures in all of them. I checked all over the place, and unless they weren't being very truthful, I was only able to find these two and Angry O. But I didn't really want to get Angry O. I like the happy guys much better. So let's take a closer look at Dancing O out of the package. Okay, so Dancing O comes with a few little pliers. So this is all about the play power. It's an app, and you scan the figure, and I guess you can play games with them. That's pretty cool. And this is the instructions on how to make Dancing O work. So let's see how it goes. I'm gonna pull these guys out of the way. Leave. We pull them back. Not sure if it's gonna work because this is kind of a uh, cloth. And yeah, it's not gonna work. I'm going to try it on a flatter surface. So I tried dancing O out on multiple different surfaces, all flat, and unfortunately, it doesn't seem that he dances all too well. I did get him to do his little dizzy spin once or twice. But unfortunately, it seems, in the case of this toy, it was a bit of a fail. He's still a nice figure though. A lot bigger than I expected. And look at that happy face. How could you not love that face? Let's move on to the next toy. This one is O's Spinning Cat. Quick look at him in the package. Let's take him out. This toy also comes with the McPlay power card and a set of instructions, and this seems pretty simple. So it seems that you just have to push the button and it sends Pig flying or spinning. Kitty. So let's take a closer look at both of these toys. Love pig on his head. Try to make this picture a little clearer. So this is pig. And O. Very cool. So let's move on to the home mood figures. All right, so these are the home mood figures. There are 18 to collect and two different ways to collect them. You have these, which are transparent balls, and you can see which character you're getting. And then they have blind capsules, which were uh, white bubbles, and you didn't know what you were going to get inside. So, consider them blind bubbles. They are for ages above three. Let's take a look at all the different variations you could get. 18 characters to collect, and they all represent a mood. I have loving O. Now something I find kind of funny about this is that they're all different moods, and then you have Captain Smack, Pig, and Baby Boo. Those aren't exactly moods. Now if they had Captain Smack as pride, Pig as adorable, and Baby Boo as, well I guess Baby could be kind of a mood, because sometimes you don't know how a baby is feeling. But just to have random characters, that's a little weird for a mood series. And if you were going to have characters, why not have one of Tip? 
that's something else that kind of confuses me with these. Of all the toys that I've seen, I haven't seen a single one of the main character, Tip. I know that they do have some out there, but I have not seen a single one. Quite unfair, because she's the main character in the movie, and she doesn't have a single toy. Also, these were released by E-Kids or Kid Designs and DreamWorks. So let's take Loving O out of the package. O comes in this little capsule. He came out of the package quite easily. Just pop him out real quick. Looks a little bit like a balloon. And this is Loving O. He's made of hard plastic. That's a little bendy, but he doesn't move. Try to get it to clear up a little bit. He's a nice pink color. A blue and purple uniform and I think they make larger versions of these that change color but I don't think it's of every mood and in the bottom there's a hole usually I question why there's a hole but it actually turns out that if you bought these as the blind bubbles it comes on a base a little half circle that kind of makes it wibble wobble Unfortunately with these, it doesn't come with that, so you just have a weird hole in the bottom. But if you have the ones with the base, they kind of spin or wobble, and you can take them off the base and just have them stand up as figures. If you want to see a quick size comparison of the two together, the Happy Meal toy is much bigger. I also think that's probably about the size of the color changing O figures, but I haven't seen those in store either so I couldn't say 100%. And next up, I will be showing off Pig. I was so happy I was able to find Pig. I only saw it in one store and they had just set them out and I grabbed him right off the shelf. Out of all the packages, there was only one of him. A lot of, let's see, I think a lot of the grumpy, naughty, and bashfuls, but only one Pig. Pig also comes in a little balloon shaped pod and when I first saw him he kind of looked more like a guinea pig than he did a cat. But again I am so happy I found him. He's a chubby chubby kitty. And the reason he's called Pig is his swirly curly tail. And Pig also has the hole for the base that if you were to get these as the blind capsules, he would sit on. So, this is Pig. And show him compared to his Happy Meal equivalent. Adorable. So these were the four toys I was able to get based on DreamWorks recent released film, Home. I do know that they also had a few plushes, Captain Smack, Pig, and O, as well as two talking plushes of Captain Smack and O. In the comments below, tell me what you think. Do you like the minifigures better? Or do you like the Happy Meal toys? Again, I still never saw a single toy that represented Tip in any way beyond Pig. Did any of you find any Tip toys out there? Do you think the moods listed on the package and the way that O is sculpted represent what the mood means? And how are you feeling today? Make sure to put those in the comments below. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And follow me on Instagram and Tumblr. And until next time, everybody. Are you feeling Captain Smack today? Or are you feeling more Baby Boove?